Only on five boaters feeling priced out of their passion. It's not just the fuel cost, that's bad enough, and that certainly has boaters worried, but mooring rates have also spiked in recent months, so much so, some wonder how much longer they may own a boat. WPTV's Todd Wilson has one city looking at what could prove to be a more affordable alternative. John Sheffaletti and his friend Dennis Ushman just finished a day of cool wind in their hair and a bit of ocean spray on their skin with the Jubilee. Sheffaletti says recreating that feeling each time is getting more and more expensive, especially with slip fees. I've been looking around for like the last six months and Palm Beach Gardens slips are going for between $800 and $1,200 a month for an under 30 foot boat, which is, you know, that's unheard of. So Sheffaletti keeps his boat in the yard, but recently he heard a rumor about the city of Riviera Beach. I was thinking about putting my own mooring out, and then I heard that you were good, the city was going to do it. I was going to send an email to Sprague, you know, because I had just looked his name up. Who is Sprague? That is John Sprague. The lifelong boater and the Riviera Beach Police Department's Marine Unit took me out to see where Sprague will help build not one, but two mooring fields, totaling 156 moorings. There's 56 spots planned between the city marina and the Blue Heron Bridge. The other 100 will be south of Peanut Island. He says they've surveyed the area. Installing moorings requires a special dive team to screw them in. It's measured under hydraulic pressure until it reaches the gauges that we're looking for that will hold a 60-foot boat in the windage of a Cat 3 hurricane. Well, John says building a mooring field is just a smart thing to do. Just to put one moor in the ground averages between $3,500 to $4,500. Now, when you compare that to building a slip, it's upwards to $150,000. He says it's simply just cost effective. So this mooring fields are going to be an affordable alternative. Sheffaletti and Ushman say they feel they're being priced out. The expense gone way up. It gets to the point where the average person can't, unless you are very rich, that you can put your place in a uh, dock. In Riviera Beach, Todd Wilson, WPTV News Channel 5. The city says it'll have a boat to collect sewage and a boat to transport from shore to boat and back. The time frame for starting the work, well, that could be a year away.